you couldn't dream this up. You know, it, you know, I, I know people said fairy tale around the story, but uh, that's what it is. Just walking up to him, I mean, you know, your knees get weak. You, you know, I know what it does for Cody. You know, we've seen seen him go through so much. You know, it, it just flattered us beyond words uh, how uh, you got a racehorse named after your son. They're off in the dirt mile. When they went by us, the energy uh, that you get from that, you know, uh, is, is incredible. You know, you can't describe it. Cody's wish in the blue colors, blazing by horses on the far outside. That whole place erupted and it was like a tidal wave coming to us. They were nose to nose. So I knew it was going to be really close. It's Cody's wish and Cyberknife. Slow down Andy in between horses. Down to the final 16th. Cyberknife on the inside. Cody's wish on the outside. They're coming down to the finish. Here's the wire. Oh, the wish has come true. That one's for you, Cody. I couldn't tell he won. And all of a sudden, all these hands were smacking us on the back and hugs and people just crying everywhere around us. And I, I knew he won then. If I made a point to thank Cody's wish, I said, he picked us, we didn't pick him. You know, we were at the farm for the uh, Make-A-Wish event, kept tugging and tugging, and he come up, kind of sniffed around on Cody and this lady's nose in his lap, and he's done it every, every time since then, incredible. <laughs>